is stuck in the abyss. So I put out this tweet the other day. Here, I'll show you uh, the image. Nine years of content creation. So anyways, what I wanted to address over here, I have 18 channels made and 11 of them were failures. However, four things were successes. Most subscribes, 276,000 subscribers. Do you guys want to see the failed channels? Of course! I think I have a list of them. I know you have over 10 staff. I think I have closer to 15 now. Do you have a cooking channel? No. Okay, and all right, I got them all. Okay, let me show you all my failed channels. Let me just close this so I don't hear the music all the time. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys all of my past mistakes. Not all of them, I think there's like two of them that are hidden, mainly because they weren't really serious attempts at channels. First up, we have Harumba Red X. This is not a failed channel. This one actually does well. Currently, this channel has 276,000 subscribers. Oh my god, why is both the spider and Akiza on this page? <laughs> Whatever, who cares? Wait, maybe I should make the spider a little bit smaller if he's gonna be on this page. There we go. There we go, much better. Okay, so anyways, this is the the Haruma Red X channel. It has 276,000 subs, which is more than the, the Yu-Gi-Oh! channel. However, with 273,000 subs, this is the most popular channel. It gets about five times as many views as the other one. You guys want to know what my second most viewed channel is? Is this one right here, the Duologues Duologues. With 22,000 subs, this is my second most viewed channel. And this one is actually my third most viewed. Views are way more important than, uh, than subs. Okay, so these are the successful ones anyway. Now let's go over to the unsuccessful ones. First up, we have Hiru's Pet Battle Videos. This is a channel about pet battles in World of Warcraft. <gasps> well, my most popular video has 141k views. 137k views? That's not half bad. So, Pet Battles in World of Warcraft is like a mini game like Pokemon. The last stream was two years ago. And uh, I, I, it kind of petered out towards the end. That was two years? Yeah, I guess that makes sense. And BFA was the last time I did it. The reason this channel failed was because Blizzard doesn't support pet battles. So, <laughs> the whole point of the channel <laughs> was just uh, completely defunct because there's nothing to do. In fact, I made a video about it on my World of Warcraft channel right here. What's the point of pet battles? <laughs> Where I basically just talk about... So here's this neat feature that Blizzard made that I really liked, but then they abandoned it. So I kind of abandoned it too. Um, however, it did have 6,000 subs and it was actually influential for a time. Like there were a series of people who started doing pet battle channels because of mine. Like, uh, you know, I met some people who were actually inspired by the channel. That was surreal. I was like, whoa, out of all of my failed channels, this is definitely one which had actual, like, people who were fans of it. I had someone who, like, sent me a whole bunch of free pets and game that were very expensive. But it's, uh, I, I, I don't really make videos for it anymore. It's just, it's too, too much of a niche, and I really can't make videos about things unless it's fun. Anyways, next up we have the awesome top 10s. It has 2,000 subs. There's lots of videos on this channel. Wow, five years ago. <laughs> this is basically just a generic channel with uh, with Google image stuff. Oh, I have so many stories about this channel. Some of these don't have half bad views, actually. Top 10 facts about turtle. Yeah, this is just a ironic video about random bull. I, I think every other one is just making a joke about how the world is run by reptiles. Fun fact, did you know whales and sharks are very different creatures despite the fact they look the same? I, I learned that recently. I didn't know there was such a huge difference between them. Top 10 fruits? Okay, so this channel right here is just riddled in stories. So, I mean, this one is a joke, and this video actually seems like it did well. I, I don't remember it having that many views. Top 10 fruits. 
So, the reason I made this video was because one time someone was making jokes in Hard Lake Joe's channel and he was like, hey, uh, Mr. Mr. Dulog, do you make top 10 videos? Haha, <laughs> top 10 videos suck. Anyways, what if you made a video about top 10 fruits? That's a dumb idea. You would do that, wouldn't you? They didn't say that meanly, but that's kind of what they meant. And I was like, uh, I don't really want to do that. They're like, how much would it cost for you to do a top 10 fruits video? And I was like, well, you know, the amount of time and effort it would go into that, plus uh, the expertise and how much I would lose working on that instead of something else, it would probably be around $500. And they're like, ha ha, okay, I'll give you $500 to make a fruit video. And then um, next time I stream, they donated $500 on stream. And I was like, all right, guess I'm making a fruit video. So I made it. And they're like, uh, we we're kind of expecting you to put it on your, your Duologs channel. I was like, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not going to Palma. upload a fruit video on the Duologs channel as a joke. That's stupid. And because of this fruit video, I don't give people like numbers anymore. Like if someone's like, hey, how much to do this, you know, ridiculous thing? I tell them no. I don't give them a number. They're like, hey, how much hypothetically for a face, an actual face cam? No, because sometimes people will actually redeem it and they'll just give you money and make you make a top 10's fruit video. Anyways, the rest of the channel was actually made by uh, an editor. Like, I, I tried to get this one work before I started making top 10s on the Yu-Gi-Oh! channel even. So I had trained an editor for this channel because I thought this channel was going to be big. And um, what ended up happening was it wasn't big for a various numbers of reasons. I didn't really know what I was doing at the time. However, since I had an editor trained for this channel, I just put them over on the Yu-Gi-Oh! channel and it was much more successful. Since they had the experience working on this channel, they were much more well equipped to start working on the top 10s on the Yu-Gi-Oh! channel. Because remember, the Yu-Gi-Oh! channel was not a top 10 channel. The Yu-Gi-Oh! channel, it's my most successful channel now, but it wasn't in the past. It was always just like my second most and it was never like actually successful. Because all I made were replay videos. Like look at this, eight years ago? Why it's banned eight years ago? Like it's just replay videos. I just didn't start making thumbnails until later on. And this just continues until 2018. Like, I didn't think there was a future in making top 10s for WoW, for Yu-Gi-Oh content. Because it's just a, a card game. It's like, it just never occurred to me to try. But then I was like, well, I can't make my replay videos anymore. And I have the editor for this channel. So, hey, might as well just try Yu-Gi-Oh top 10s. And the funny thing is, my first Yu-Gi-Oh top 10 failed. Like, it didn't do well. <laughs> So uh, I'm really glad I, I tried a number two <laughs> because the channel is like very successful. So yeah, this is uh, yeah, I already watched it. Did the video on Oblis fail? Uh, yeah, I wanted to make more anyway, but like I've just moved on to other projects. <laughs> Here's my next one, the unfunny jokes. Out of all of my failed channels, this is one that people ask for a return of the most. So I have a background in animation, but also a background in terrible drawings. So, uh, ooh, this one was actually one of my videos. Two toasters are sitting on a counter. One toaster says to the other, do you ever feel empty inside? Like a void that just needs to be filled? Yet, no matter how many social connections you make in your life, that hole only grows larger, not smaller. Am I different, or is this a problem everyone goes through? Is it normal to be empty inside? Is this how everyone feels, and no one just ever talks about it? The other toaster turns to the first and says, Holy crap, a talking toaster! <laughs> oh, I Palma. love this channel. That was a good joke. <laughs> So yeah, the unfunny jokes, it's all just anti-jokes like that. Like, the entire channel is just that. Oh, I really like this one. Jean Bol- Hold on, I need to adjust my, uh, monitor thing a little bit. Paul Sartre is sitting at a French cafe, revising his draft of being and nothingness. He says to the waitress, I'd like a cup of coffee, please, with no cream. The waitress replies, I'm sorry, but we're out of cream. How about with no milk? <laughs> <laughs> One of the big themes in Santra's philosophy is the idea of genuine choice versus the appearance of having a choice. So he can't meaningfully choose to have his coffee with no cream because he can never have it with no cream to begin with. But he can meaningfully choose to have it with no milk. <laughs> you see, they were out of, cream. Out of cream. 
How about with no milk? <laughs> so he can't have it without cream. So he's like, okay, we don't have any cream, but how about with no milk instead? <laughs> oh, and have you ever wondered why I use Ghost for my ad videos? It's because of this channel. Oh, I like this one too. An infinite number of mathematicians walk into a bar. The first says, I'll have a beer. The second says, I'll have half a beer. The third says, I'll have a quarter of a beer, and so on. The bartender pours two beers and says, you guys really need to know your limits. <laughs> Ooh, what's this one? Which day of the week do fish hate? Fry day. Ugh. Ugh. So bad. Not all of them are funny. Anyways, so this is a failed channel. The reason this channel failed is because these videos, despite how bad my drawings are, take forever to make. Oh my god, like these 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 animations. Despite how crude they are, so much time and effort. Oh my god, you have no idea. It's just a ridiculous amount of time. I think I have a video on this channel doing like a speed lapse of it. Like sped up by four times of just making a, a, a six second one. I don't know if Flash even works anymore. I think it's like Adobe Animate now. I don't know, I don't have Flash installed anymore. I think I'd have to download... I have the Adobe Suites. I could probably still make these. Can I make one of these ghost drawings in a moat? Uh, it wouldn't really make sense. I only use the ghost for ad videos now. Like, the reason I use the ghost is because, like, I don't think I can get away with using, like, WoW or Yu-Gi-Oh characters in the skits for, like, the ads I do. However, the ghosts are things I created myself for the, for the jokes channel. So I just use those instead. Wow, even this time lapse is too f oh slow. Is this the the blonde joke? Oh yeah, onioning the layers so that you can draw it over and create the animation. Yeah, so basically animation just takes a really long time, even if the a drawings are- Palma. I wonder what video this was for. Oh, the confused blonde joke. How do you confuse a blonde? Paint yourself green and throw spaghetti at her. <laughs> what the <f> Palma. <laughs> Oh no, not the whale joke. The whale joke's terrible. Uh, okay, so yeah, this this channel failed because um, animation takes too long to make and I was running this channel alongside like five other channels and I had to stop and I, I only focus on the ones that were actually profitable because I was just like I had to focus on my health because I was having a lot of health problems at the time. So I, I just couldn't work on my channels anymore so I had to cut them all. And unfortunately, this is one I had to cut to. Like, I like the videos. I, I thought they were great, even though they didn't get any views and you can't possibly make any money from this. Like, if a video doesn't have at least eight minutes, then you don't make any money from it. So, unfortunately, this is like the only, of all the abandoned channels I have, this is the only one people ask me to bring back the most. And I totally get it. I like it too, but it's too much time and effort. And like, the videos just don't make enough money for how short they are to like justify hiring someone to make the animations either. Like, the channel is just a huge drain on resources. Like, you know, the resource of my time, or just money if I paid someone else to use their time to make the videos, because they're just not going to make any money. However, if I make enough money, I could just do these kinds of channels without having to worry about making a profit. <laughs> Which is something I, I am open to in the future. So anyways, let's go on to another one. You can play ads in those videos, and they can be short, generate money. Uh, shorts don't really make money either, but like, you're right, shorts is definitely a better format for these videos. Because YouTube at least pushes them out to get views. YouTube shorts are still kind of a new thing, and they're not very successful. From like, all the things I've seen about them. Next up, oh, I miss this channel. Out of all the channels, this is the one I miss the most. Hero's Metroidvania. I have a video explaining what is Metroidvania. What is Metroidvania? <gasps> Metroidvania is a genre of gaming that involves gameplay very similar to 2D Metroid and Castlevania games. While not all Metroidvania oh, games Ori. are in 2D, a vast majority of them are. Now, to get a little bit more specific about the genre... This is before I removed breaths from my stuff. Metroidvania games are in 2D, a vast majority of them are. Now, to get... Did you hear it? I breathe in. Vast majority of them are. <gasps> I didn't used to cut that out. When was this video made? 2000? Yeah, that makes sense. I didn't start cutting it out until 2018. Ah, the audio is so bad. <laughs> Thanks for the 100 bits again, Snoop Snail. <laughs> Wish I could just delete all my old videos. Bit more because you were either blocked off by an obstacle you can now destroy, or because they were located in God a place damn it, you can't reach. Goddamn! Edit the breaths out, you stupid idiot. This past is me. called backtracking. 
and a good Metroidvania game will have lots oh of Oh my god, you left lip smacking in too? This video is terrible. Thanks for clarifying, I'm getting to these things. Great video, time and fun. Thanks video, you just explained in a few words. A lot. There were some people who like didn't like that I said boss fights need to be part of it because that was just something I added. A Metroidvania doesn't have trash bombs, it doesn't have a boss fight. There are some Metroidvanias that don't have boss fights in them. Okay, so um, the Metroidvania channel with 500 subs is basically just a Let's Play channel, but for Metroidvania stuff. Only Metroidvania games, and that's it. So I played through all of Metroid Fusion, Axiom Verge, Zero Mission, and then a couple of others that you can't see. And I think the last game I played on here was the AM2R remake, which was really hard in the version I had. The niche logs. I really liked this channel a lot because it gave me excuse to play new games. <laughs> But man, I got to play so many good games because of this channel. Like, if it wasn't for this channel, I wouldn't have played through Axiom Verge. And I wouldn't have played through Ori, which is like one of my favorite games ever. So, obviously the reason this channel fails is because it's a Let's Play channel. Like, who the f*** watches Let's Play channels? Axiom Verge is- yeah, Axiom Verge is so good. <sighs> my poor Metroidvania channel. I loved it so much. I should just become a Metroidvania streamer and get no views because nobody cares about Metroidvanias except for me. I don't even care about Metroidvanias very much. Just stream, I like it. No, nobody will watch it. Like, here's the problem with, if I just started streaming these games on this channel, the big problem it would do is ruin the branding of the channel. Like, people would come into the streams and they'd see me playing something that's not Yu-Gi-Oh! And they'd be like, what the f***, this isn't Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm gonna go watch something else. And then the next time they see me go live, they'll be like, oh, last time he wasn't playing Yu-Gi-Oh, I think I'll just check something else. And if you do it enough times, then people start ignoring your notifications, and you don't want to do that. Like, unless you build your brand around this, which I could do, because the stream is still new, but I don't really want to. Like, I don't really play video games. <laughs> well, either I play is Yu-Gi-Oh and WoW. But man, I miss that channel. Anyways, Heroes of the Storm, I like the name of this one. This was just uh, Let's Plays, but for Heroes of the Storm, which is a dead MOBA that I really liked. Let's see, the last ones, I basically just uploaded some stream VODs because I'd sometimes stream the game after I was done. Lee Ming with fan- Oh, I didn't even make thumbnails for this. Oh, I miss not making thumbnails. I hate making thumbnails. Man, I remember when I used to play Hot- oh, I love Hot- No, I still love Hot. The only reason I stopped playing was because I don't have time. I don't have time to play video games at all anymore. Hot's is still super fun. Like, I highly recommend Hot's over any of the other MOBAs. Hot is such a throwback, I know, right? Man, I'm looking at these and I just remember all the thumbnails I have to make nowadays. Look at all these thumbnails that I had to make. This is so annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Having to create a new thumbnail every day. This takes so much time. I swear, I spend like 10% of my work week just making thumbnails. Anyways, we're going over failed channels. I didn't make thumbnails for this channel either. No, I Holy sh- I didn't make thumbnails. Oh my god. Poor past me. I wish I could just go back in time and give them YouTube advice. Be like, make fucking thumbnails, you Just said bad word again. Past me. Make- make thumbnails. Also, don't title your videos this way. Also, don't make a Let's Play channel. Make a clip channel instead. Make- edited video essays about these. I should make a, a general gaming top 10 channel. Hots is still around? Yeah, Hots is still around, but it's been like abandoned. Like, people still play it. You can get a match pretty fast too. Like, I didn't stop playing it because it was abandoned. I stopped playing it because I don't have time to play it. I used to do like a gamer night on my Discord every Friday, and after a while people would, wouldn't really show up to stuff, so I would just play Hots instead and be like, hey, you can come in and play Hots if you want. And after a while, all I did was just play HOTS because I just wanted to play HOTS all the time and nobody would join me. So eventually I canceled the Gamer Nights because nobody wanted to play HOTS with me. Which, I mean, their loss. Next up, Heroes Ask Reddit. This channel right here, 289 subs. Last video was four years ago? Oh, I didn't know it was that short ago. You waken Razor Heel. So all I did was just read all Ask right. Reddit threads. It's time for get that energy back. All I did was read Ask Reddit threads from Reddit. This is actually, there's some really popular channels that have done this concept, but back when I did this, no one else had been doing this. Like, I wish there was someone who would go through, like, Ask Reddit threads and just read it. Because, like, I would much rather have had them on in the second monitor and listen to them than have to read them myself. And I thought this would be a really good, just like, voice um, reading uh, practice. Which it was, but I don't think I did enough of it to really matter. 
Ask Red answers 90% bullshit. Oh. Yeah, but they're entertaining. Uh, I Usually people ask me to bring this one back too, but it's weird that I get comments about this channel even though it has barely 300 subs. And like the videos obviously didn't do well. Because like I don't think any of them have a thousand views. Oh, some of them do. Teachers of Reddit. What did a student offer you? Oh, it's because it's a doctor's nurse of Reddit despite knocking before entering a patient's room. What is never going to happen? Oh, I remember this one. Yeah, I know why this one has uh... <laughs> Okay. I'm surprised you didn't just add all hero blank channels, hero channels. Yeah, I used to add hero to everything back then. Now it's the other way around and I add dual logs to everything. So anyways, uh, you may have noticed, like, all of these channels are, like, way different from each other. Except for maybe the Ask Reddit, I mean, the HOTS channel and the Metroidvania channels are pretty similar. They're both just Let's Plays. But only two of the channels were Let's Plays. Next up, we have I Only Play Tinker. So, uh, you may have noticed a Let's Play on this channel. This is actually not a Let's Play channel. So, um, this is my anime channel. I actually made anime videos here. Man, I made this channel back when the world God only knows was still airing. Season 3 was 8 years ago? Like, for episode 8, I made a video comparing what was left out of the anime from the manga. Elsie's Fire Truck, World God Only Knows, Season 3, Episode 6, Discussion Slash Manga Comparisons, World God Only Knows, Chapter 238, Discussion. It doesn't really go much further down. Popular upvotes, the concert scene, World of God Only Knows. Basically, this channel is why I don't make anime videos, because there are so many copyright claims. Like, it was ridiculous. And, um, so I played Honey Pop with a friend of mine. And I put it on this channel because it was my anime channel. Oh, the game's banned on Twitch? Oh, I was just showing a scene of it. Actually, TOS? <gasps> well, anyways. <laughs> it's fine. People stream whole movies on Twitch. They don't give a sh Palma. Twitch crying right now. Anyways, this was my failed anime channel. I think I had some more stuff on here. No, it all got taken down. Top 5 anime of the winter 2016 season. <gasps> What were the top five nice animes of the winter video. 2016 top five season? currently airing shows of the winter scene. The f*** is this music? I like the best. I made a point to try all the new upcoming shows. That anime sucked. Ooh, Hayaku started airing then? What the f***? <gasps> oh, I didn't know that was 2016. Only, easily total badass. These screenshots I took. Oh! <gasps> two episodes out right now. Yeah, that's what it was called. Momokuri. Dude, so Momokuri. I f freaking loved this anime. I liked it so much that I wanted to read the manga. But there was only one dude who was translating it. And he didn't have enough funds to pay for it. And he set up a Patreon. Which is odd because they don't usually do that. And I don't. It. <laughs> I gave him money so that he could translate more... Momokuri. <laughs> and I think that's the only time I've done that. That's how much I like this anime. Whoa. That's the best video on this channel. Everything else sucks. Anyways, that was my anime channel. I abandoned that because of copyright issues. So this is a, a crappy top tens video. I don't know why there's no videos on the channel. I think I deleted them all. Because like the whole point of this one was like, I'm going to make top ten videos, but they're going to be bad. And the videos were actually just, you know, like really low effort garbage. I think I took them down because they were dumb. <laughs> Yeah, and in the thumbnail, it's it's Hakua from The World God Only Knows, because I was obsessed with the show at the time. And then this one here is ASMR VODs. I still upload videos here. This is where I used to put my VODs. And occasionally I'd upload non-VODs too. Because I used to stream on Twitch, but like only once a week. And I put my, my VODs here. This is my VOD channel, but I abandoned it. And now I just sometimes upload my guild's kills. So it's basically an abandoned channel. Ooh, the Azeroth Weather Channel. This one was abandoned recently. This one actually has 10,000 subs. Out of all the abandoned channels, this is probably the biggest. And also has the most amount of videos. Because I, I would make one video every week. And then there was other content I made too. Where I basically talk about my opinions on, wow. Duologs actually just addicted to making YouTube videos? Exactly. So my last video was actually eight months ago, but I clipped out a portion of one of my videos on the WoW channel and I put it here because I didn't want to upload it to the main channel. So basically I use this channel to just put my WoW stuff. 
Anyways, in this channel, all I would do is just make news videos, but for WoW. In this video, we'll go over all the WoW news from the past skirmishes. 340 less health than it did. Finally. You too cute. Oh, I so, uh, as you can see, the views were terrible. The subs... I actually used to have 11,000 subs. I lost 500 subs. <laughs> the channel was in a slow decline. I would make it every week. There were people who would always be like, I hope you don't stop making videos here. The reason I eventually stopped making videos was because of the, the Blizzard lawsuit. I didn't want to make videos anymore about WoW. And I quit the channel because those are... I was already too much effort anyway for no reason. <gasps> oh no. The stream is down. Disconnected.